Hello, I'm Dave Blissner from Clay Coach Online. The good people at Vista Outdoors, who work on behalf of Federal Ammunition, contacted us recently and asked if we'd like to do a field test of some new ammunition that's being released from Federal in 2017. Of course, we gladly accept. The product they provided us for field test is the Federal Premium Gold Metal Grand Competition Clay Target Load that's coming out in 2017. With the variety of ammunition overwhelming the consumer, it's common for shooters to purchase cheaper shells without much thought about performance and interaction with the choke. In this video clip, we will show you how to precisely evaluate your preferred cartridge choke combination. We will also be giving you a live side-by-side -side comparison of popular ammunition with Federal Premium Gold Metal Grand ammo to investigate several of their claims. The gold ammo and its popular competitors, red and green, will be equally matched in terms of load. Before we head to the range, be sure to cut six 36 inch by 36 inch squares of paper for every cartridge choke combination being tested. This will be our target. After they are cut, we will draw a 30 inch circle around the center of the paper. We recommend a hula hoop, but anything will work. Then draw a vertical and horizontal line through the center, cutting the circle into four quadrants. You can also purchase pre-made targets through online hunting and shooting retailers. Once we get to the range, also remember ear and eye protection and to ensure the firearm is unloaded and secure before heading down range. When that's taken care of, we'll head down range and put up the first target for our patterning evaluation. Now that we're down at the patterning board, you can see that there's a, a backing on here previously. There's a steel plate behind and it's either a plastic sheet or cardboard. In this particular case, we already have the backing, so we're just going to go ahead and use that. Be sure to secure the patterning paper to the backboard. A bright marker at the center of the target will help with aiming and ensure repeat accurate shots. Mark the brand and shot number on one of the corners to ensure accurate results. We're back up at the uh, um, firing position now and there's two things we want to do. Is we want to use a set of aiming sticks to make sure that we move any variability due to the shooter out of the equation and we also want to verify the range to target using a laser rangefinder or in the old school way, you can use a piece of rope that you know what the length is. Well, we've got our target uh, mounted down on the patterning board. It's now time to fire. What we're going to do is step up to the aiming sticks, make sure everybody's out from down range, put a round in, squeeze it off, and get a good impact on the target. Well, we've got one shell left. It'll give us six targets, which gives us a good average distribution of shot pattern on targets so we can do the math. Now that we've shot the uh, Federal Premium Gold Metal Grand uh, loads that are coming out in 2017, we're going to be shooting the comparator load that we're going to call red. Now we're going to try our second comparator which we're referring to as green. That was the on-range portion of evaluating shotgun patterns. In the next part, we will make a workstation to show you how to analyze results and discover whether Federal Premium's new ammo lives up to its gold medal name. 